Malcolm and Alicia, some of those big names include Detroit Lions safety James E. Hedebo, Wayne County Sheriff Benny Napoleon, and the pastor of a well-known church in Farmington Hills. All of them appealing to the judge in this case, asking for a lighter sentence or for substitutions to be made in place of a long prison term. Asker will return to federal court this afternoon, we're learning, and his legal team knows it will be hard to avoid any jail time. But they're hoping the judge will consider an alternative sentence because of Asker's charity work. A jury would find Asker guilty back in November of 2014 of conspiracy to defraud the U.S. government and of filing false tax returns from years 2006 to 2008. You may recall several others were already sentenced for their participation with these crimes. And of course, we will have complete coverage for you of this case on later editions of Action News and online at WXYZ.com. We're live outside the federal court. I'm Nima Shafe, 7 Action News. Now, Nima, you mentioned some of these big names. What are they suggesting instead of prison time? You know, it, it, it's not necessarily in place of all the prison time, Alicia, but they know that they know that it, avoiding any prison time will be really hard. But in this case, one suggestion includes uh, community service, full time community service, upwards of two years or more. Another idea to pair Asker with the kids from the Detroit public schools so that he can teach them a lesson or two on entrepreneurship. All right, we'll see what happens in court. Nima Shafi, live in downtown Detroit. Thank you.